Hey everyone, I'm Duran. I've just released my new EP Avalanche, and when we did ask me to break down an Ableton session of one of the tracks, so let's go. So here is the session of my track Minute Breath, a track from my latest EP that I composed with a Chakwachi flute player. So f first I will give you a quick listen. For the composition of this track, we proceeded in a particular way because we first recorded improvisation of the flutist and I used these recordings as sample to create melodic sequences where I then built the track around that and then we rewrote the whole track with the flutist. So I will show you the different parts of the track in a bit more detail. So we have uh, the drums first, here and here, drums that I wanted to be quite ethnic, especially with this recorded drums. And this one too. The other parts of the drums are sound sample from machine or other groove box. And concerning the, the mixing of the drums, I always try to make it simple, not to add too much effect, to keep it realistic. First to record well, to have the sound I want from the start, and then to use essentially simple EQ and compressor. Plus obviously some group compression to glue it together. Here an emulation of the first child and some group reverb. Here is the filter. Okay, now we have the bass from my Arturia Matrix Brut, which I use a lot in my production. this one I want something quite groovy, aggressive, sharp and powerful. On the bass I don't hesitate to put a lot of treatment in general directly at the record or after. Here we already have a lot of effect on the record, like saturation, chorus, etc. So what I added afterwards is mostly dedicated to the mix. So first we have a compressor, then a transparent EQ to cut some eye, then a pull tech to color it a bit and add some bass and finally a compressor dedicated to, to the sidechain now the instruments group this is a pretty basic group because I use a lot of acoustic instruments in my track So here we have a strict section with two violins and a cello. Also some brass. And of course, we have here the Chakwa Chiflet. Concerning the treatment on the instrument, it depends a lot on the different track and the desired sounds. Sometimes I use a lot of EQ, saturation, compression, and sometimes I use just a little EQ. Here, I basically cut some resonance that bothered me and cut the lows.
Concerning the flute mix, I can't show it fully to you because I used an analog chin in the studio, which consisted of one Neve 8801 EQ, an LA2A compressor, and a lexicon reverb. I then re equalized a bit to cut some frequencies that were a bit too aggressive. You don't have to do that all the time, but as my track is very full, I have to cut some frequencies or some resonance to avoid a too aggressive and shooty result at the end. And although I had, of course, a nice reverb on the instruments group, here the fab filter. And finally, we have the leads. which are quite discreet in this track and which will play the same melody as the violins but with an electronic sound. And finally we have the pads. I always use pads like this in the background to set the mood of the track and it's often where I start a track. And in closing, a little tips if you want to widen a sound with delay, you can, you can use the Ableton delay. Set this to time. Set 1 to 1 ms. And the second to more than 1 ms, depending on how wide you want it. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this little tour of the Ableton session of my track Minute Breath and don't hesitate to ask me a question if you have any and uh, have a good day. Bye.